Hey, okay, okay, good evening. <laughs> good evening, teacher. Hey, hey what, what are you laughing at? Que dije nadie quiere entrar y solo nosotros. Ay, Thursday. It's little Friday. Okay, how are you tonight? I'm very good. Very good. Perfect. Let's get it started then. So, one more time. Welcome to Invest Corporativo. We are going to finish tonight with beginner three. Yes. Perfect. So, I have a quote for you here. Let's see, let's read this quote to, to start. It says, if you are not willing to learn, no one can help you. If you are determined to learn, no one can stop you. Okay, one more time, listen. If you are not willing to learn, no one can help you. If you are determined to learn, no one can stop you. Uh, can you repeat after me, please? Okay. If you're not willing to learn. If you are not willing to learn. No one can help you. No one can help you. If you're determined to learn. If you are determined to learn, no one can stop you. No one can stop you. Okay. Hector and David, welcome. Hi. Okay, we are practicing this quote. One more time, let's repeat. Let's practice. Repeat after me, please. If you're not willing to learn, no one can help you. If you are not willing to learn, no one can help you. If you are determined to learn, no one can stop you. If you are determined to learn, no one can stop you. Okay, very good. Do you understand this? Yes. Okay, what is the meaning of willing? Uh, uh -huh. Ricardo, Hector, David, what is the meaning of willing? <coughs> dispuesto dispuesto yes and learn what is learn 
Yo no creo que vas a aprender. Sí. sí. Oh, yes. Uh, I'm sorry, but I have a sore throat. I need some water. Perfect. So, nobody can stop you when you have the determination to learn something. No matter the time, no matter the age, no matter the, the money, no matter the difficulties. If you have the determination to learn something, nobody is going to stop you but if you don't want to learn no matter if you have the best teacher the best school the best books the best university you are not going to learn because you don't want to Okay, so the disposition of the student makes the teacher. Yeah, if you want more, the teacher is going to give you more. If you don't want anything, well, the teacher won't give you anything in that way. Okay. Even in life. Yes. Okay. So is your hunger. It is your hunger to learn. What is going to make the people teach you. Okay. Hector, can you read this quote, please? If you are not willing to learn, no one can help you. If you are determined to learn, no one can stop you. Okay, remember determined. 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 De, determined. De, de, determination. E -D. De. Uh -huh. de. Determined. De. Okay. David, can you read it, please? <clears throat> If you are not willing to learn, no one can help you. If you are determined to learn, no one can stop you. Yes. And Ricardo? If you are not willing to learn, no one can help you. <clears throat> if you are determined to learn, no one can stop you. Okay, remember this. Dijimos que nunca íbamos a decir el. ¿Ya? Is determined. 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 Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay, very good. Now, let's continue with tonight's class. Tonight's class start with some vocabulary with this vocabulary about school days okay the vocabulary about school days the, the days that you were in school do you remember your school days Yes. Yeah. yeah. What school did you go to, Hector? Hector, what school did you go to? With the question, please, I have a problem with the Wi Fi. What school did you go to? Uh, junior uh, college. Yeah, what school? 
My question is, what school did you go to? I'm asking you, what school did you go to? <clears throat> I went to external San Jose school. Ah, I, I went to Santa Cecilia school. Ah, okay. Ricardo, what school did you go to? I, I went to school. Bachillerato, este, se llama José Damián Villacorta. Ah, okay. Navy, what school did you go to? I went to Don Bosco School. Okay, good. Okay. So let's take a look to this video about school days vocabulary. Let me mute your okay. microphone for a moment. Hi everyone, in this class you'll learn vocabulary for discussing school. Let's get started by listening and practicing. Classes History Math Physical Education Science Schools College Elementary High Junior High Places, classroom, gym, lunchroom, playground. Now, I would like for you to do a couple of things. First, I would like for you to categorize the vocabulary into three different sections. Classes, schools, and places. For example, under places, you can add classroom. Then, I would like for you to ask and answer questions in the past using the vocabulary that we just learned. For example, where did you go to elementary school? What were your favorite subjects in high school? Try to make as many questions and answers as possible. After you finish this activity, share your work in our discussion forums. Okay, okay, okay. We have this vocabulary here. here. Here it is. Okay, here we have this vocabulary about school days. <clears throat> Let's practice, please. Repeat after me. Classroom. 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 College. College. Elementary. 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 Gym. Gym. Hi. 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 History. 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 Junior high. Junior high. Lunch room. Lunch room. Lunch room. Math. 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 Physical education. Physical, Physical education. education. Playground. 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 Science. 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 Okay. And we have three categories here. Three groups. Classes. Schools. And places okay the idea is to put this vocabulary in these different categories 
Okay. For example, classroom. Okay. Classroom. Oops, what is this? Uh, classroom goes here. Okay. College, well, it's a type of a school. Okay. So, goes here. Okay. So, I will give you five minutes to classify this vocabulary here and then we are going to compare and check okay 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 very good uh, um, okay i don't remember if i put that in the group but i'll do it right now <clears throat> okay, there you have. Five minutes to do it, please. Hello. Hello. Hello, Hector. Hello, Saul. Yeah. Uh, this, is, this is the exercise with my partner? Or? No, individually right now. Okay, thanks. Individually, and then later we are going to compare. Okay, thank you.
Okay, did you finish? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Okay, what words did you did you write here for classes? Science. History. No. History. Night. Night. Hello. Science. What else? Math. 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 <coughs> what else? Um, history. Yeah, physical. Yes, physical so education. Education. Uh huh. PE. Usually, you you're gonna see that like PE. Physical education. And, uh, yeah. Mm, yes, sir. Okay. So we have let's say history, science. Math, physical education. Okay, what about um, schools? College. College. Elementary. Hi. Okay, okay, okay. Give me a second. College. Elementary. Hi. Hi. Mm -hmm. Hi. Junior high. Junior high. Uh -huh. Okay, we're good. So we have 
college, elementary, high, and junior high. And finally, places. Playground. Okay. Gym. Lunch room. Lunch room. Gym. Lunch room. Gym. Uh, gym. Lunch room. Playground. Playground. And lunch room. Okay, classroom, playground, gym, and lunch room. That's it. Chain, yes. gym, lunch room, and playground. Okay. Any question with this vocabulary? No, I understand it. No. Okay, what is junior high? Um, it is a secundaria. Escuela secundaria. Well, okay. Let's go from the beginning. We we'll start with elementary. Elementary is from first grade to uh, sixth grade. Then we have junior high. It's like from grade seven to nine. And high school, which is like bachillerato here. Bachillerato. Uh -huh. And college. College. Es como un técnico. ¿no? Mm -hmm. What is playground? Yeah. What is the playground? El patio para jugar. Yeah. La zona de juego, okay? Okay, very good. No questions here? No. No. Perfect. Let's move on then to the next activity. We have this story. How about this person, Ricky Martin? Ricky Martin. Okay, there is a video about this story. So let me play the video to hear about Ricky Martin. This Ricky Martin, Ricky Martin. Okay, here it is. Listen to this story, this video. Hi everyone, in this class you'll develop skills in scanning, reading for specific information, and sequencing events. Ricky Martin was born in San Juan, Puerto Rico on December 24, 1971. He was always a performer. As a child, he appeared in television commercials and studied singing. At the age of 12, he joined the Latin boy band Menudo. Okay, I don't know, I don't know what happened with the video. Can you hear me? Okay, give me a second.
Can you hear me? Yes. Yes, ah, okay. I don't know what happened with the video. Suddenly stopped. Okay, no, no problem. Let, I will read it for you. So. Soy un poco cortado, teacher. Really? Okay. Worked hard with them, and he ah. became very well known. But he left the group after five years. Wow. Martin moved to New York City, but he. Is the internet maybe or? Didn't work for a year. On the video. He was very frustrated. No, ni se ve bien. Let me see. Okay, no se ve bien. was born in San Juan, Puerto Rico on December 24th, 1971. Okay, he was always a performer. As a child, he appeared in television commercials and studied singing. At the age of 12, he joined the Latin boy band Menudo. He worked hard with them and he became very well known, but he left the group after five years. Martin moved to New York City he didn't work for a year. He was very frustrated, so he moved to Mexico City and got a part on a Mexican soap opera. Soon afterward, he recorded two Spanish language albums. After this success, he moved back to the U.S. Back in the U.S., he appeared on an American soap opera and in the Broadway show Les Miserables. Then he made his first English language album. That album was called Ricky Martin. His biggest hit, Live in La Vida Loca, was on that album. Now he's famous around the world, but he still works hard and he still loves singing. As he said to a reporter for the newspaper USA Today, I want to do this forever. Okay. Okay, let's go back here. So this is about Ricky Martin. Um, I have some questions for you about this, this short biography. So what I want you to do is first you have to complete the questions. Can you see the questions? Yes, sir. I see. Okay. I, see yeah. I already. I, see this. I give you the questions, but they are not in order. Okay. So first, you have to put the question in the correct order. For example, number one, the the question is, where was Ricky Martin born? Okay, and the answer. He was born in San Juan, Puerto Rico. So first, you have to write the question correctly and then find the information and respond the question. Is that clear? Yes. Okay. It's clear. Okay, the two pictures are in WhatsApp. So you can you can use the the pictures from there. Okay, I'll give you five minutes to do it, and then we are going to work together again to check your questions and your answers. Okay. See you in five minutes.
Okay, did you finish? Hello. Hello, Dad. Yes, I am finished. Okay, very good. <clears throat> so the first question was, where was Ricky Martin born? The answer, he was born in San Juan, Puerto Rico. What is the next question? Okay. Ricky Martin. Uh huh. When was Ricky Martin born? When was Ricky Martin born? Okay, Jamilet, ask that question to Ricardo. Okay, Ricardo. When was Ricky Martin born? He was born on December nineteen. Uh, well. Twenty-four. Yes. Twenty-four. Mm -hmm. Nineteen seventy. Nineteen seventy-one. Nineteen seventy-one. He was born on December twenty-four, nineteen seventy-one. Very good. Okay, Ricardo, can you ask next question to David? <clears throat> okay, hey Claudia, where did se nos fue Claudia? Pasó. Ah, Ricardo. No tiene Ricardo o no? La otra sería que ver. What did Van join he with? What did Van join he was he was? was hmm. What? What one? Mhm. Did did he join uh, when was was twelve? Yes. What band did he join when he was 12? That is the correct question. What is the answer, David? <clears throat> he joined the Latin band Menudo. Yes. Okay, David, ask next question to Hector. Okay. Where did he move when he left the band? Microphone, Hector. Okay, um, uh, can you please repeat the question, Ricardo? Where did he move when he left the band? Mm -hmm. He moved to, the, to New York City. Yes. Okay, next question, Hector, to Jamilet. What do did he after the success in Mexico? Repeat, repeat. What do what did he he after he success in Mexico? Okay, okay. Ahí se está comiendo el verbo. What did, what did he do? He do. He do. What uh -huh. did he do? And what did he After do? He success in Mexico. Okay. Uh, he moved to United States. Yes. Very good. And Jamilet asks the next question to Ricardo. Okay, Ricardo. What did he say to a report of the United States today? Ricardo, do you listen to me? Ricardo. 
You are here. Where are you? He left. <laughs> what is the answer, people? He said. He said, he said I want uh, to do this forever. Yeah, he said, I want to do this forever. Okay. You can uh, practice with this reading, uh, making more questions, okay? So you Hola. can try. Hello, Hi. welcome. Hello, Ricardo. <laughs> Perdón, estaba ya hablando. <laughs> hey, Claudia, welcome back. <laughs> okay. oh, she left again. <laughs> Okay, so you can make more questions. That is a good way to use these, these articles. You can try to make more questions, okay, and respond the questions. Okay, people, that would be all for today. So with this, we finish this module. Okay, remember... Uh, to complete the platform and to y entregar su papeleo, ¿verdad? Ok. Pero, eh, sí, para terminar la plataforma tienen hasta el domingo. Bien. Es la okay. última fecha para terminar la plataforma con un 80%. Y... Okay. Eh, Y el papeleo, ¿verdad? Pero recuerden que el papeleo no sirvi servirá de nada si no terminan la plataforma. ¿Ok? okay. Ambas cosas son importantes. Okay. Y parece ser que el inicio, si, si todo marcha bien con el papeleo, sería a el 2 de marzo. El próximo módulo. ¿Ok? Okay. 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 ¿Alguna okay. pregunta? Um, no. Thanks for all, teacher. Okay, you're welcome. It has been a pleasure to work with you. To Thank meet you for your time. To me. Okay, no problem. You're welcome. So, I don't know if we are going to be together in the next module, but if not, have um, keep going, keep studying, okay? Remember, if you are determined to learn, no one is going to stop you. Determination, you can do it, you will do it. Okay. Okay. Okay, bye-bye, have a good night. Good night, you too. Okay. Good night, God bless. Blessings, everyone.